And we have people interpreting the laws, and they always give us a bad interpretation. So uh, hopefully we've shown some light on the Ninth Circuit. I know that uh, Chief Justice Roberts, John Roberts, has been speaking a little bit about it. And I think we've — and I have a lot of respect for him. I like him and I respect him. But I think we have to use some common sense. This nice Ninth Circuit, everybody knows it. It's totally out of control. We find that it's um, — it gets to a level where we are going to lose control or where people are going to start getting hurt. We will close entry into the country for a period of time until we can get it under control. To the entire border? The whole border. I mean, the whole border. But I don't know if anyone's going to be able to conclude that the crown prince did it. But uh, I will say this. I, I don't know. I don't know. But whether he did or whether he didn't, uh, he denies it vehemently. His father denies it, the king, vehemently. The CIA doesn't say they did it. They do point out certain things. And in pointing out those things, you can conclude that maybe he did or maybe he didn't. But there's no — that was a, another part of the false reporting, because a lot of you said yesterday that they said he did it. Well, they didn't say that. They said he might have done it. That's a big difference. But they're vehemently denying it. And we have hundreds of thousands of jobs. Does, do people really want me to give up hundreds of thousands of jobs? And frankly, if we went by this standard, we wouldn't be able to have anybody as an ally, because look at what happens all over the world.